Good morning, what is up? So today is the start of a new vlog, which is exciting. Um, my third weekend in my life here in New York City, so I'm super excited. But I'm actually about to head to the gym because I haven't worked out in like three days and I feel gross. And after I go to the gym, I'll probably go to Trader Joe's because I wanna see if Saturdays are actually like not super busy because I've heard that rumor. But like Trader Joe's is always busy in the city because it's just like the cheapest to get everything. So who is texting me? Good Lord, I'm not popular, I promise. Be back in a little bit. Today's plans. I think I'm gonna go to the Met um, and see the Heavenly Bodies collection because it's still there, which is awesome. Um, Cause I am one of those people who religiously like will wait for all the Met Gala pics and just like fawn over all of the clothes. Like everything was so beautiful this year. So I'm really excited to go and see like the inspiration behind everything. So yeah, um, but let's go hit the gym and be fit. So I missed the bus by literally 0.2 seconds and I would just walk but I kind of overdid it at Trader Joe's so now we're waiting for the next one that'll come in like 10 minutes it's fine no but okay so I just got back from Trader Joe's in the gym gym was good it was like empty in there there's no one in there so Saturday mornings are the time to go um, and Trader Joe's like the line was like almost non-existent and that is like literally unheard of so also Saturday morning is the move. So basically from now on, all of my Saturday mornings have to be productive, so yay. Um, so I just came back from Trader Joe's and honestly, I'm like kind of mad that I didn't shop there in college because I got so much stuff for like super cheap. So I'm just gonna like do like a super quick like rundown of what I got because I don't want to do, I don't want to do a haul or like this is what I get from Trader Joe's because like honestly I don't really know like all the good things to get at Trader Joe's so I want to like survey the store and figure it out first and then do like a video on it or like then insert like clips into a vlog or something but if you're curious to see like things that are definitely good you can go to our blog and Hannah just posted a Trader Joe's haul with things that she's picked up for a while now so if you want like an intro to Trader Joe's you can look at that um pretty much like they they have like a set standard of things that like everyone gets at Trader Joe's but you know I'm kind of trying a little bit of different things just to see what I like so anyway let's just see what I got welcome to my kitchen it is nice right now because it's like daylight but it gets super dark in here otherwise so over here we just have some yogurt that I'm gonna try. I haven't had this yet, so hopefully it's good. I've heard good things about their yogurt. So this is just the Greek non-fat yogurt and strawberry. Got some eggs, bananas. This mango stuff, I can tell you, it's absolutely delicious. Like, I love these. Um, they have no sugar added to them, so they're just like freeze-fried mango. So good. I got some salted tortilla chips, um, pita. I got the whole wheat this time, because last time I got the original, which were good, but I wanted to try the whole wheat. Um, I got some watermelon spears, some strawberries, these green beans I got last time, absolutely delicious, um, to, really nice to saute with like chicken and bell pepper and potatoes. I got some cooking spray, which was pretty cheap, maple syrup, um, a green pepper and red bell pepper, uh, some garlic powder. Uh, I want to try this almond beverage, <laughs> I don't know why it's not called almond milk, but um, almond beverage to see if it's good. Um, pretty much I just put this in smoothies so it really doesn't matter all that much and then in uh, oatmeal then I got a thing of baby spinach which we know I love and then I got a whole host of frozen things like honestly TJ is like best <laughs> for frozen things so I got sweet potato fries um, some frozen berry medley frozen strawberries um the mandarin orange chicken which is actually really freaking good like really good um some alfredo with grilled chicken vegetable fried rice mango chunks guacamole the blueberry waffles that are super delicious and turkey burgers which are super cheap and super good as well so that is pretty much what i got um i meant to get i meant to get why are you not focusing dude 
focus on me. <laughs> there we go. Um, so I meant to get some shredded cheese because I want to make an omelet, but I forgot. So I'm just gonna like slice up some pepper jack cheese and kind of call it a day. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to make some breakfast, put this, put all that stuff away, and then probably message some some of my friends in my program to see what the plans are. I really want to go to the Met today, so that's kind of what I want to do. But we'll see. Oh, I also have a package coming, so I gotta get that. But yeah. Um, also, I need to post a blog because I was supposed to post it yesterday and I totally forgot. So yeah, we're gonna go do that as well. Yeah. But I finished making breakfast. I made a cup of coffee and an omelet with spinach and pepper jack cheese and a banana. So my omelet that got kind of messed up on the pan, so that's fine, and then banana. Yeah, let's dig in. I'm gonna watch some Brooklyn Nine-Nine while I eat this, cause yeah. All right, y'all, it's a couple hours later. I posted a blog post, watched Brooklyn Nine-Nine, worked on a vlog, and then I showered and got ready, and now I'm just eating some chips and guac. Pretty good. So today, so I'm about to head out to the Met. I'm going with a friend that's in my program um, here for my PhD. And we're gonna go to the Met and explore a little bit. So I'm excited to go uptown a little bit. I haven't been like all the way up to the Met yet. So that'll be fun. I have, well, since I moved here, I've been to the Met before. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm gonna do a quick little outfit of the day. So I'm wearing this jumpsuit that I got like, I wanna say like two years ago from Old Navy. It's super cute, it's floral. It has a really fun pattern to it. it just looks like this. Um, and then I'm wearing these right now. Uh, they are the Nikes that I got from the end sale. I don't know if it's cause like you can see my socks or like what's happening, but I kind of feel like a soccer mom a little bit. And I don't know if that's like the look I'm going for right now, but it's, I just don't want to wear sandals. It's really hard to wear sandals in New York City if they're not like super comfortable. So I like, don't want to do that. And these shoes like go perfectly with like the colors in this jumpsuit. No one really cares. Like I like it, I think it's fun, but I think some people are gonna be like, what are you wearing? And that's okay, it's really fun. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna head out. I will try and get some clips. Um, while we're like I don't have my like I don't have my stick on my camera so like my arms are short so I feel like I'm cutting my head off but it's fine um so yeah so I'm gonna head out real quick and fast after I accessorize a little bit so yeah Gabby here and um, I just got back from like going to the Met and then we went to Shake Shack after the original one in Madison Square Park always a good option always good but the Met was so much fun seriously the heavenly bodies exhibit is so beautiful and like the designers that had like pieces in there Valentino Givenchy Balenciaga like all of these big name designers that were inspired by the Catholic Church in some way like made these beautiful pieces and that was so incredible to see and I'm so excited to like get to see that exhibit every single year after the Met Gala it's gonna be so much fun like ugh ugh and then 
it gets better it gets better so if you're a project runway fan you will love this because literally i saw tim gunn in the met at this exhibit like the tim gunn like the iconic timothy gunn i don't actually know if that's his name but uh and he was wearing his little tim outfit with his like nice dark wash jeans and his suit jacket and tie and i was like yes tim we wanted to get a picture but like he took a picture with like a pretty big group of people and then like a lady went up to him and i assume asked him for a picture and he was like oh, i'm just trying to enjoy the museum like sorry and i was like <sighs> but it was fine it was really funny i like kept trying to like get like boomerangs or like a picture of him and like he kept move like tim gunn moves so fast like he would like look at the exhibit he'd like probably say something like tim gunn would say and then he would like sprint away and like we don't know how he kept like moving so far ahead of us so quickly but yeah that was incredible that was like my first celebrity sighting in new york so here's to many more because that was really fun like that honestly that was so much fun and uh tim gunn yeah but so now i'm back home i'm probably just gonna like watch netflix and relax um tomorrow i have some plans so you'll see more tomorrow of the city uh but i got a package today so i'm gonna unbox that um in a hot minute but the first thing that was in it was a check <laughs> from unc that i need to deposit because your girl needs all the money she can get lol and then my dad gave me my birthday present. I got some AirPods. There you go, yes. So I got some AirPods. I, I am so excited for these bad boys. Like everyone in the city literally has AirPods. I don't really know how they work. I just know that people rave about them. And so I'm excited to finally have a pair. Like literally walking around with those freaking strings hanging from my ears. It gets stuck, some, it gets stuck in my ID, it gets stuck in my purse. It falls out all the time. So excited for these I'm really excited yeah so I think I'm gonna sign off for the night because I'm not really doing much else other than watching Netflix which no one really wants to see in a vlog I feel like why am I orange because <laughs> my lamp that fluorescent light though cute um yeah so oh I feel like so I'm just gonna go ahead and sign off for the night I will see you guys tomorrow for some more adventures in the city yeah i'm also trying really hard to look at the camera because it's really hard not to look at yourself i'm not trying to look at you i'm really trying it's something that you just have to like force yourself to do um but yeah so i think i'm gonna go ahead and sign off for the night because i'm not really doing anything else really except for watching netflix so yeah fun i'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs>